would you please tell her that you're not really Santa Claus? That there actually is no such person. I wish I was the girl from the Gucci store. She never wore any makeup and she owns Couture. I got pimples where my beauty marks should be. I got giant skin on my elbows and knees. I never liked her. Wanted to be like her. Hate how you look. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, this is going to be kind of like a prep with me for Christmas, kind of. Um, obviously, I look like this, and Christmas is in like three days or something like that. So, we obviously need to look a little cuter. Um, so, also, um, tomorrow, I'm going to, I have to get some last minute gifts. We you know, last minute, I have to get some last minute things, so I'm going to the mall tomorrow. Um... And then I think I'm going to try and attempt to reinstall my wig in this video too. Because I think that's kind of the hairstyle I want to do. Because I didn't really just if I do anything extra. But that's kind of like what I was thinking. But before we get into tomorrow, what I'm doing today is I have to retwist my god brother's hair. So I'm going to give out like a behind the scenes of that too. Um, but that's just like random. But the real Christmassy stuff is turning this into like cute for the holidays type of thing. Um... And yeah, and I also have to wrap um, some presents. And I'm going to show you guys all the gifts that I got, everybody. And here's some like wrapping paper. Like, this is like my theme wrapping paper that I'm going to do for everybody. It's like this really cute glitter wrapping paper. Like, please don't tell me it's not cute. I think we got this from Target. It's, yeah, Wonder Shop at Target. But it's really cute, glittery, on theme. Really cute. So that's going to be... The theme of what I'm gonna wrap everybody's gifts in, and then I also have gift bags that I'm going to bag up. Um, but yeah, like that's pretty much what this is gonna be. We have to prep and get all cute for the holidays. Um, so yeah, but first, I actually just got a package in the mail, which I bought this like a month ago, and this package is actually let me put you guys up. I actually got it's from Amazon, and it's like. I guess it's like a brand, but like they sell it on Amazon because it came with like a card and stuff. But this is kind of like a Skims dupe, and I bought this simply because Skims was not in stock with the fold over pants, right? And then I saw somebody had bought this and was like, it's just like Skims. And I'm like, okay, like I really wanted the look of the pants. Like it wasn't even like, like this whole set was like maybe $30, $40, like $20, and I'm almost up to buying the Skims. Like Skims was like 60 so I could have really just got the Skims. So it wasn't really about it being cheaper, but mainly because it was not accessible to me. But it is a plus that it was $20 cheaper. Anyways, so this is the foldover pants, and it's from like this Amazon brand. Um, I'll probably put it on the screen or link it below. But it did take a while to come. It said it wasn't supposed to come until January. Um, I mean, that's close enough, dang it, but... So, like, they have, like, a fold of her waistband, right? And then it's, like, comes all the way down, and they're just, like, flared pants. And, like, I'm short, so I really hope these fit, though. Like, I'm a little worried about that. I'm going to try these on. But, and it also came in the set. You can't buy it separately. And it came with, I thought it was kind of cute, though. It came with, like, the long sleeve. I might wear this tomorrow, though. It came with, like, the long sleeve to match it. And I do have, like, the Skims Heather Gray, which is kind of, like, just what the dupe is. So, I wanted to compare it. And I think that this is like the cotton one. And I think this material is kind of maybe like the cotton jersey or like the fits. I don't know. But this is like the texture is 100% different. But I think I just have the different type of skims texture one. But like they look pretty similar. I feel like this one's slightly lighter or maybe I'm just tweaking. But like let's see. Like this is a shirt. And then... These are the pants, like, you could definitely wear this if you wanted to wear the shorts, like the short sleeve shirt. But, like, I feel like since it's cold outside, I would wear this together anyway. But let me go try this on and see if it fits, um, because, like, I hope it fits. And I got these in the size, I think, I don't even know, bro. Hold on. Oh, so I got the pants in a size medium, okay. All right. I don't know why I did that because these are stretchy. Why would I get a medium? I honestly think they say it's the size down. I think that's why because I don't typically would do that. And I think I got the top in a size small because I don't wear it. I don't know. We're going to see these fit. So hold on. 
Okay, here's what she looks like. These are the pants. I don't know, guys, if I like this. I think it's just like a lot going on. And then the top. I don't know. But like, they got the fold over. You know? And they're not that long. Like, it's chill. Mm. Okay, this is also the brand. I guess another chill. I don't know. But I guess I'll try and link it. But like, it's not bad. Like, try it. Like, it's not bad. Like, it's what Skims is. Like, this is really how it is. I think it's just a lot. Like, I think it's a little cuter with the short, short sleeve. Let's go put the short sleeve one on. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, I think the short sleeve look is more my speed. Like, I think this is more like my speed. It's like not too much fabric going on. I don't know. Like, I mean, it's cute, right? I mean, it's like really cute, like, you know, loungewear. Like, it's cool. And like, these are the, like, the colors together. Like, it's really the exact same thing. Like, it's actually kind of crazy. And they're not too long either. I'm really five feet, so. This would be cute to, like, lay over. Tall girl friendly? I don't know. <laughs> but they're cute, though. Like, fold over, you know? <sighs> but that's that. Okay, we're back into our regular clothes. But also, I'm going to show you guys. I just look so wild, like. Anyways, but I went to the beach bar store and I got some more things for like when I reach his hair. And I also don't like, I don't know if you guys see me do hair, like I do braids and stuff, but I don't really like service it to like just random. Like I'll just do like my friends and stuff like that and family. But I don't like have like a booking site. I don't have a page. I don't have none of that. And like a lot of people have been telling me to like, especially being in college, to like start a page, like start servicing people, especially in like the college, like at UMD and stuff like that. And I'm not opposed to it, but it's just like one thing I won't do is I'm not doing braids, bro. Because imagine going to class, going to practice, and then having to sit down and stand on your feet for 10 hours to do some small knotless to the knee length braids. I'm not doing that on a tooth. On a Tuesday, I just can't imagine me doing that. Like, I was do to my friends on the weekends, 9 a.m. And I could service, like, every weekend I do, like, a couple heads. But it's just not worth it. It's just not worth it. Like, for me personally, it's not worth it for me. Um, So, I'll just do it with my friends when they ask or when they come home for holidays and stuff like that. I'll do that. But what I would do is I was just telling Ty this. I was like, I would 100% do service locks like i actually have this girl on my team and she has locks right and she's like new to like you know getting her locks done and i wish i would have taken a picture and recorded it but i basically added extensions onto her locks and it's basically like i did like senegalese twist basically onto her locks and it's my first time ever doing it it looks so good like she loved it and she had it in for like a minute like she had it in for maybe like a month and like some change i don't even know if she took it out yet i don't even know but we on break now, but before break, like, she had them in for a minute, and it looked so good. And that didn't take too long, but even then, that's like, I don't know. I still didn't finish at 12 a.m. Um, but what I would do is I would service, like, if people have locks and they want retwist. I would do retwist, charge her a cool $40 for a retwist. That takes, like, two hours max to do. Um, I'll style it, you know, all that. Um, and I've been doing Ty's locks for a year. I started his locks, actually, so I wouldn't even mind starting people's locks. Um, and then also I do my brother. My brother doesn't have locks, but he has like curly hair. So I wouldn't mind like doing twists, braids, all that. Like that's not bad for me. That don't take long. That all takes about two hours max and I don't mind doing that. So I'm thinking about doing that. Seeing what my spring schedule is like and I might start doing that. But um, for now we're just gonna stick to the family, friends, clientele. But anyways, um, I got some more stuff in Beast Pass store. Because I needed some more clips. So I got some more clips. These are just the pack clips that I use. Also, this is the oil that I use. Um, I also use the Lock God, which is like this, it's like lock titian that has like oil and it's like lemongrass. It's really good for locks. But for right now, this is Camille Rose. Um, what is it? Ultimate Shrimp Serum. It's really, really good. So I use it in my hair. Um, and then I've got some more rubber bands because um, he's getting two strands. So with two strands, I need to secure rubber bands and then i got a new comb because i need another like fine point comb i keep breaking these like these are so cheap i mean they are a dollar but 
Um, and then I just have other clips. And then this is the braiding gel that I use, which is like the, I mean, uh, bleh. this is braid gel, but like I use it for locks. This is the best one I found so far. I've used like three different brands. I use that like $30 one, that little really thick one. I joint is trash. I joint is like turns white. This one, I'm going to show the brand, is braid locking gel. I don't even know. What is this brand? Curl? I don't know. It's bomb. Take, take a screenshot. To seal it all up, I just used this Design Essentials, my favorite mousse. It smells so good. It's just like a regular wrap mousse, um, but it just smells really good. And I just use this to put it over. And then this is just the setup. Just my chair. Well, I don't sit here. Like, whatever client would sit here, I would just sit here. Ring light, because I can't see worth nothing. So I need the ring light to be dead in a scalp, because, yeah. And that's just my table. It just has all my stuff on it. Pick it up, put it back. Now something like the chemist on campus. Good morning, guys. Um, it is the next day. The last time I saw me, I was doing hair. So the next day, it is December 23rd, and I am getting ready to reinstall my wig. So that's why we have the little gel braids in. I really think I did a good job. Like, I do not know how to braid on my head at all, and I hope this is not blurry. But I don't know how to braid on my hair at all, but I feel like, like, it gets the job done. Like, it's just supposed to have it back. So, like, I just be coming on this camera looking wild. But hopefully after this reinstall, it looks better. But, um, yeah, so the plans for today is I'm about to reinstall this wig. It's 10.55, and I'm going to the mall at 3 o'clock, and then at 5 o'clock, I'm going bowling. So that is the plans for today so we're gonna try and get this cute get this hair done so we can look cute for like this christmas weekend and yeah and this is the wig right here i basically already washed um dried and then also cleaned off the lace because the lace was like obviously dirty but i'm really having troubles with like i don't have a mannequin head so i try to like hot comb it back but like it just it's so hard y'all so i just have this little hanger and i'm just hanging it on the towel rack so it just looks a mess but yeah so also like the wig that i bought it came with like a ball cap and everything and it's the hd wig cap or whatever so i'm about to just do the whole regular ball cap method um i'm still gonna use like the edge brush it came with so that i can like not use mine and i'm just gonna take some got to be i'm just gonna spray it all around my edges and I'm just gonna push all my edges back because I don't want my edges like with the glue and stuff. We wanna make sure our edges are safe. Stanley Kubrick. This is some visionary shit. Been trying to film pleasure with my eyes wide shut, but it keeps on moving. I blame it on a model bra with the Hollywood smile. Strip a booty with the rack like wow. I'll never forget ya. You put me on a field and I never had. Never had, never had, never had. And ever since I've been trying to get it back, you pick it up, put it back. Now I'm something like the chemist on campus, but there's no drug around. I like what I found. You, you, I still can't feel my face. What am I smoking anyway? She said, Don't let the high go to waste. Can you taste it? Little taste, no became, baby, baby. No became, baby. I want you. Fuck me good, fuck me long, fuck me now. Love me now when I'm gone, love me now. Love me now, love me now. Love me now, no became, no became, no became, no became, no became. Love me pain, love me pain, love me pain, love me pain. 
just got done like installing it and then I put it into a side part. I put uh, like an edge stick and then I took like I have the old fashioned hot comb where I put it on the stove and I just kind of like make sure it laid flat. And I have my melting band on and my edges are just laid out like here. And I'm gonna leave this on for an hour. You know why? Because Ekane said that. And if you know, you know. So I'm keeping this on for an hour. It is 12 o'clock. We're gonna come back at one o'clock and I'm gonna go ahead and style her. And I'm just gonna do straight side part edges. Simple, cute. And yeah. All right, hey y'all. I am at Ty's house right now. Um, but I'm about to show y'all the hair. Why? I don't understand why my hair is about to die. But let's hurry up. But this is the hair. Um, the curls have literally dropped. Here is the outfit. Y'all, literally my camera died, but she's charging right now. But we're playing Fortnite. I'm gonna, let me show you my outfit, like my full outfit, because I know you haven't seen that. And I gotta recurl my hair. So, I got my wand so I can recurl it, because she is completely, ooh. We're back, my camera had to charge a little bit. But here is the full, like, outfit of the day. Um, but yeah, so this, this, um, top is from Zara. It's like a pink, like, cardigan, like, slightly cropped a little bit, but it's, like, really cute. I've had it for a minute, and then this is a set that I showed you earlier from Amazon, and then I just have my Asics on, because, I don't know, I feel like they just match, and then, actually, this top is the actual Skims top. These pants are the dupes of like the skims or whatever and then my A6 and they are flared. And this is how they like fit on like I'm really five feet, so I'm not sure how tall girl friendly they are. But this is it and this is the hair. I just did a side part and now we're about to recurl it because the curls are falling. Like so yeah, let's get to recurling. Let's take this off because I just know that we Hot. And then jewelry, so I just have my watch on and then necklace, and that's it. And this is also how it looks, the better look of the outfit. But we got our curling iron, and we're about to just curl her. If I need to touch it up, I have a hot comb. Like, I got some wax stick. I got my spritz. And yeah, and also let's like rate like what I did. So like it was a middle part at first. I just changed it to a side part. And like this is a close up of it of my lace. Like I did this all by myself. Never done this before. But like this is so good. Like I also feel like I gave natural. Like I didn't even care enough to pick out all the like the extra hairs. But like I feel like this side is what's like messed up a little bit. But like I just gotta fix it. But like this is really like what matters. And then over here. It's kind of messed up. I, it's not even messed up. I just didn't care enough to do the edges over there because it's getting hidden with the side part. But this is what she looks like. I think I did a pretty good job. When I pull up, that's when the party starts. In the booty club, standing on the couch, throwing my beans. Better respect me, bitch. My people's in the cut with them things. Wifey got me icy, now my chain hit like loud bling. In New York, with my partners, we be jamming high. I mean, if you see me and you trying to see what's up, if you wanna fuck with me, then I'ma have them stuck. Bitch, looking bad and got a stupid butt. Jewelry on your wrist, fuck it, hold it up. When I have a ski, let me pull up. Hey guys. <clears throat> all right um we had to quit stop because mr hungry man can't hold his belly which is okay because i can't hold mine either baby if i'm hungry i'm hungry but change of plans it is literally 4 4 46 y'all and we were supposed to be at the mall at three, like at least three thirty, because we have to go bowling at five. So it looks like we're going bowling first, and then we're just going to like swing by the mall real quick. We don't have to get anything like major, but we're going to swing by the mall, and we don't have matching pajamas. We don't have no photo shoot lined up. We don't have absolutely nothing. So we're just going to have to see. But that's going to be another. That's going to be another vlog, but. Anyway, so we're gonna go to the bowling alley right now, and then we're gonna swing by the mall later. I think my brother's gonna come meet us, and then when I get home, I need to wrap gifts. 
that's it because i'm not doing it tomorrow i just know it and we exchange we exchange our gifts tomorrow so i have to wrap his gifts today so that i can give it to him tomorrow and then my family's gifts i can wrap that whenever but i probably just today anyway just get it out the way easy peasy little sweetie but yeah <laughs> that's it that's all i have no lip gloss like i'm just so lip gloss. Oh, well, all right, y'all. So. Yeah, yeah, I had 200 for lunch. That's not I put on a cunt. No cap, 24 shows in a month. All right, y'all. So, we're obviously at the mall. I was in the little mall bathroom. Um, I'm gonna show you guys we're in Tyson's 2 in Virginia, by the way, um, if you care. Does my hair look fine, guys? Like, wig gurus, am I, is this okay? Like, it's obviously not perfect, but I think it's not bad for the first time. And like, I don't even care Like that it's like, there's some hair like stuck in the lace, but I just don't care. It kind of gives that messy look, just like, I'm cool with that. But let's go leave you for Ugh. I'm trying to open this freaking door. All right. No time. So nice. Fit check. Fit check. That sounds cooler. Tell them where it's from. Bro, it's a Nike sweatshirt. With some UA socks. <laughs> Well, y'all, I'm sitting here by myself because he made me mad. And the place is right there. I'm not going in there because he made me mad. So now I'm sitting out here. He made me mad. But like. Never let no man try to tell you what your place is. Uh, uh, uh. But it's okay. We look cute though. Let's see if he's gonna come get me. I'm a bad, okay, at 6.48, I'm gonna update y'all on if he comes get me or if I go in there or if he calls me. All right, update, it's been a minute and he texted me and he said, he said, we at the end when you come to the left. He said, if you're leaving, let me know so I can tell my mom. I told him I'm going home because he pissed me off. And I have the keys, and it's my car, so maybe I can leave, or maybe I should go shop. I'm in Tyson's shoes, maybe I should. Let me go treat myself since he took me off. All right, current time, it's 5.55, and he came and got me. <laughs> women on top, women on top. <laughs> Resume the normal vlog, we just had an intermission. Oh, thanks, kind sir. Woo! So nice. It's so nice. Me and my baby friend. Period. Period. I got it. I do. Oh. Oh my. Oh my God. Oh my. Hey, he got higher than her, bro. Oh. Dang! Why did you get? Oh, you got higher than him. This is this is cool. Uh oh. Oh, that was speed. Oh look. That was speed. Oh, I got it. Oh, I got it. He's wearing it. He wants it. Dang! <laughs> you gonna get it? He got 56 points. No, I got 574. Uh oh. Y'all, my brother about to hit the jump. Watch out, Tyro. Start, bro. Start 11, bro. Please, 
You got. Oh yeah, it's oh, all yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. No bad, no that was bad. better. get his ears pierced how you feeling before or after okay before your interview how you feeling okay okay and y'all he just cut off his locks too so we got a fresh bib ish but now he about to get sweet with the 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 left side wait no, that's the right side we're waiting for shawty to hurry up being clear clear y'all pause because back in the day i swear to goodness it used to be like 15 dollars to get your ears pierced why is it sixty-four dollars for one? No, I am old. Like, but that's insane. Why is this hot? You said invalid password. Oh no, you're good, girl. Boom. Oh, yeah, my man, looking sturdy. Hey, shawty. Double pierce. Hey, shawty. She got a flight, nigga, can't even see me on way out of here, I'm too far in the sky. Heard me, it's Ash for the dog, my ass. Bitch, so pretty, look better than Cassie. Puffin' on Zooters, and she callin' me daddy. Walkin' on shit, turn it up and I guess. Came out the car, and ain't never me to swag it. Secure the bag, got a bitch, I'ma beg it. Turnin' it up, got a make sure she good. Parker two million and build up my hood. Takin' no mud, I made out of the sword. Chrome hard accessory, do that one good. Out of these niggas, they lookin' the same. They copin' my lingo, they bitin' my chain. Championship, championship, ain't just go. Schnauzers. All right, y'all. So we are back home, and it's like really, really late. I think what time is it? It's 11:54. It's not really, really late, but it is kind of late. But before we go to bed, I just want to wrap ties. This is just tie section to give. The rest of my family's gifts I'm gonna wrap tomorrow on Christmas Eve because today is Christmas Eve Eve. So um, and me and Ty we exchange our gifts on Christmas Eve because we're with our families on Christmas Day for them. I show y'all what I did get him, and his main gift are these um, the Jordan 11 Gratitudes, and I have the Concords. He has the Concords, but he ended up trashing his Concords, and the Gratitudes are basically like a remake of the Concords. The only difference is like the bottoms are not icy. It's kind of like a cream bottom, but this is what I got him. Yeah, um, they dropped like last week. So that's his Christmas gift. That's the big one. Um, and then I got him two pair of jeans and a t-shirt. This is a, which ones are these? These are just a pair of G-Star jeans. I don't know if I know that brand, but it's like 
you know, boys be wearing the G-Star jean brand. It's his favorite. I got these like a month ago, like a minute ago. And then I also got him a shirt to match the pants, also from G-Star. And then this is more of a bigger gift, like the second biggest gift is a pair of purple jeans. Y'all know how them boys go crazy for the purple jeans with a little tag on the back. But he's actually never owned a pair of purple jeans or like a Miri's. He never really like thought to buy them. And he was just like talking about it like, mm, I kind of want some purple jeans. I was like, bet. And these were like on sale on, on Saks, like a little bit on sale because they still was a little pricey. But they were on sale on Saks. Um, but yeah, they're just like this blue, like, I don't even know if see but it's blue with splatter pink. And then it has like the purple patch. Yeah, and that's really it. And like, it just doesn't feel like a lot, but it's just those little things. Are a lot of money like it's only four things but these were like big four things you know like nothing was like under a hundred dollars type of joint but i'm just grateful to give back and i'm gonna share my family's gifts tomorrow all right y'all it's the next day and i did not finish up my gifts yesterday only because i look crazy like scarf all on the forehead but the only reason why i didn't wrap it oh it's christmas eve so happy christmas eve um, but the only reason why I didn't wrap it yesterday was because I was using, you know, the glitter wrapping paper, right? And with glitter wrapping paper, which I know this, like, I knew this. I feel like this happens every year. I buy wrapping paper. It's so shiny, pretty, but then it doesn't stick to regular tape. And so I was, I was like, okay. And I looked it up and they said, like, the best way to, like, to have it stick is to use, like, the sticky, like, little circle like sticky tack things and i don't have any of those it has them at school which is crazy but i don't have any at home so i couldn't use that because you know no matter how much i tried i had got my big girl tape out i was using little girl tape i was using masking tape i was using all types of tape to see if it worked but it's just like glitter you know obviously there's no like adhesive grip to it in the tape and the glitter but no worries i obviously have more wrapping paper and i actually forgot i bought this because i liked it and i got this um it's like really cute like i wish i would have these in pajama pants these are the type of pajama pants i would love to have like some tight pajama pants with like a long sleeve top and then like some legging bottoms like that's so cute i think fashion nova has some just like these but but like this would be cream i'm just i'm just brainstorming but anyways this is what i got got it from target um it's only like five dollars and i use a pretty significant amount and i finished wrapping the gift so let me show you here are the gifts and I basically just like put um the two pair of jeans and the shirt all together so I didn't have to waste wrapping paper and then I used like I had some I was like already I was trying to like work with this right and it wasn't working so I was like let me just utilize it some way um but like the backing of it does have like some type of like it's not glitter on the back so I was able to put tape on the back of the glitter paper just like taped on there just because i thought it was like a cute added touch and then i did the same thing to the shoe box and we have both of those um yeah and then that's the shoe box like i actually did this so perfect it's kind of crazy and i'm normally not the best at wrapping gifts but i really ate like but yeah that is that you know what this gives me like victoria's secret when it says pink 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 that's the vibes give me. So that's it. Um, yeah. So stay tuned for the next video. It's going to be like Christmas Eve vibes. And we also still don't have matching pajamas. Y'all last year. Like last year we had a whole photo shoot. We had pajama. Like just. It's okay y'all. But we're going to get them today. Because we actually did go to Old Navy and we saw some, but they didn't have pants. They only had like tops. So I'm gonna go to Old Navy, like closer to my house, and I'm just gonna go over there and go see some and go get some because I'm the choice. So I'm gonna get whatever I see. But that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for the Christmas Eve vlog today. Stay tuned for the Christmas Day vlog um, of me opening my gifts to my parents and gifting my gifts to my parents. And also stay tuned for New Year's vlogs. We have some New Year's moves um and just you know bring you guys into the new year with me i thank you guys for watching and thank you guys for sticking with me um throughout this year and i will see you guys in the next video hope you guys have a blessed christmas happy holidays to those who don't celebrate 
And yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye guys. 24-7, what's the 411? When you see me now like Kaepernick, call a reverend.